This thing on? All right. Beauty, what's good? Vinny, Vinny, Vinny here with the vibes here to serve you, man. How's your day going, man? I hope you guys are still abundant. I hope you guys are connecting to your higher self. Hope you guys are meditating. But let's get right into the video. Um, It's officially October 31st, which means it's officially been three months since I got my dreadlocks retwisted. Now, I know you guys thinking, bro, Vinny, it's only three months. Bro, three months is a hell of a long time, man. I'm used to getting my dreadlocks retwisted. Um every month so every like four or five weeks but this time around um i noticed a couple of things uh with me uh taking a break from retwisting so i, I just want to give you guys an idea or like the update or you know and the uh like i said the pros and cons of what i'm actually noticing with out dreadlocking my hair for three months now uh the whole reason i started this whole you know not retwisting um the last time i got my hair done from my stylist she was just saying well i actually noticed before that my dreadlocks were actually thinning out and i was just like yo what the hell is going on now me i already i know my you know type of hair uh my hair is really thin my dreadlocks are really thin so um when i actually started my dreadlock journey it took my hair about mm, i'm gonna say like 11 12 months for it to finally lock up i just it's you know it's just my hair type um, I don't really have like uh quink like kinky natted hair. My hair is really thin and wavy. So, you know, before I had dreadlocks, I had the deep waves be. They would just naturally be. But as of right now, like I said, um, it took my dreads a long time to lock up. So, um, when she did my dreadlocks, I was telling, I was getting you know bringing it to her attention. I was like, hey, I feel like my dreadlocks on the back of my hair thing you know? and she was like yo you're definitely right she was like you may just want to take a break from it and um she actually uh crochet hooked my back of my dress to make it a little bit, a bit thicker but i was like you know man what can i do and uh i was like you know i'm just gonna take a break now with this break my intentions were just like a two-month break but um after the first 30 days, I was like, all right, I can get, I can either get my dress retwisted or not. But um, I was like, you know, I'm, I'm going to just wait. I'm going to just wait. I'm going to say, let me see uh, what I can do in month two. So when month two came out, and I was just like, yo, <laughs> bro, I'm going to tell you. So like I said, I'm used to my dreadlocks being fresh all the time. So the feeling of not feeling fresh, man, I don't know. Like it just, it felt, oh uh, man, it, it was rough. I was very self-conscious about it, but then, you know, I started to realize, like, hey, man, this is my natural self. This is my natural being. This is my hair. Get over that bullshit. <laughs> that feeling like, oh, man, I'm not, you know, handsome. I'm not, you know, proper or professional. Yo, I was like, yo, get that out of my head, man. Because, like I said, it's the first time I've ever done this. And it may not be a big deal to you guys, but just imagine you, you know, people without dreadlocks, just imagine you just, you know, going without a haircut every three weeks or for like two months or for three weeks. just imagine you you not getting a haircut like you're gonna start getting a fro you're gonna have no lineup your face gonna be looking like yeah so it's the same with dreadlocks but i knew like yo, in order for my dreadlocks to be healthy i gotta give it a break so uh month two came out and i was like you know what, man anyway money's tight anyway so i don't need to get my dreadlocks done shout out to my stylist man um she does a very very great job with my hair and uh you know she doesn't even charge the most money, but her business is growing, and I'm so proud of her because I was one of her first clients. So shout out to Bridget. Bridget, shout out. So um, uh, going through that, going without a retwist for three months, man, it's it's it humbled me, man. <laughs> um, bro, so when I tell you, like, bro, so I wear this hat like all the time, like, and you can see, look at this new growth, man. I wear this. Let me show you guys. So, you guys know I do have gray hair. Like, it's just it's just genetics. I've always had gray hair, but like, look at this new growth. All this all this you know and i noticed a couple of things with my new growth um one they're definitely not dreading up i know i've seen a couple of other videos but people say like oh, their new growth will start matting up because of my hair type mine's just not doing that right now like look at all this look at my edges bro and like i said like i i, I actually enjoyed this process because like say like you know you have a temp fade or a taper fade like kind of a shape up and you just, you know, you want to get rid of that, man? Just grow your hair back. Like, let your hair grow. Stop getting the shape up. But, like, look at all this new growth, like, that can be, like, into... Look at this. Look at this. These are not even dreaded. This is from my hairline. Like, and now I'm thinking, like, yo, you know what? I'm going to just combine it with these locks because these locks are thin. But what I have realized is, man, this he wants so much attention. What I have realized with my locks, man, like, yo, it's, it's it feels thicker. Like, I, I like how this is feeling. Like, this is... This is, these are my locks. These are my locks. But I, I'm, I'm really appreciating how 
these locks are definitely growing and they feel a lot thicker and it just it gives my stylist a lot to work with and it gives me enough time to you know you know to actually appreciate it man because that's, that's one thing I, I really started doing i started appreciating my locks for what it was like st instead of it being all dressed up all the time you know like i was like you know what, man like look look at this look how thick that is and i have a lot man it's probably like a good two inches of growth for three months but uh yeah like you know, I've shampooed it probably about like three times. I'm actually going to, want to make a video about an ACV wash before I get my hair done. But um, I don't know, man. It's, it's been three months. I was supposed to get my hair done uh, this week, actually. But I was like, I'm going to just wait it out. But now I'm thinking about waiting to four months. Like, why Why not just let this joint just grow, man? Like, and honestly, like, I was letting it grow out. While I was letting it grow out, I was like, you know what, man? I have a, a good enough length. Like, if I wanted to cut my dreadlocks, I could style it, you know? <laughs> But I was like, man, I ain't cutting my dreadlocks. I don't know. Is it just me or every time that, you know, my hair is just not done or I, I know I'm about to, I, I need a retwist that I just want to cut my dreadlocks. Like, God, let's just get it over with. But as soon as I get my retwist, I'll be like, God damn, your boy looking fresh. Your boy looking fresh. I ain't never cutting these joints off, man. But, yo, definitely, um, fellas, give your dreadlocks a break. Um, Definitely give it a break. You know, there's so many, so many benefits. It gets your dreadlocks thicker. It gives your dreadlocks, you know, you know, it eliminates the breakage point. And um, yo, honestly, I don't know what I'm gonna do, man. What you guys think? Should I go for month four? <laughs> Should I go for month four without the dreadlocks, man? Like without getting retwisted, man. I don't, I don't mind it, man. Like I really don't. Like I'm really going back and forth if I'm gonna um, get these retwisted or not. But like, look at that shit, man. More than likely, when I do get it twisted again, I'm going to get it into a two-strand twist because it's going to help my new growth stay in my locks a lot longer. I told you guys, it takes my hair a long time for it to uh, dread up. So, all my new growth, I know it's going to need some time, but uh, let, me, let me give you guys, like, the full picture, man. Yo, man, it's, it's hot in this car, but you see the, <laughs> you see the window fogging up, man, because it's... I'm in Maryland right now, so the weather uh, is kind of... I think it's, like, 60-something degrees. It's, it's not that bad, but it is raining, feel sorry for all the kids that are gonna go trick or treat in the rain tonight but uh yeah man like dog look at that joint like i said the cons is definitely like i said you're not as fresh but you know i'm fresh no matter what you know these are you know these are this is my hair this is my natural hair and you know if you don't think being natural is fresh man i don't, I don't psh, psh, come on bro but uh this is me man and uh jeez look at that joint man yeah i i told you guys i'm i'm, I'm gonna make a video about uh, my me actually started my dreadlock journey a couple of years ago. I'm gonna show you guys some pictures uh, that'll that'll probably be up uh, probably next week. I don't know. I don't know. But uh, guys, definitely give your hair a break. I do recommend it. I do love it. Like I said, it's, it's I've been growing my dreadlocks for six years, and uh, this is the first time I actually like gave it a break, man. And um, I always think of myself like I'm, I just imagine like how thicker my dreadlocks would be because um I don't know like I feel like my dreadlocks are thinned, but I mean. What you guys think, man? Look at the different colors of my dreads, man. It's like brown, gray, black. I love it, man. This is all natural dye. This, this is there's no dye. It's just natural. This is just my hair, man. I, I fuck with my locks. I really do. I really do, man. But um, like I said, it's, it's officially been three months. And uh, what do you guys think, man? Like, you, you guys think I should go for four? Or you think I should get a retwist? Like, man, look at that. Look at that. And, like, I could easily put my finger in here. Like it's not matted up. I have it. I have been shampooing it. I have been pulling it apart. Some of them, not all of them, but it's just too many, man. But what you guys think, man? Like I said, it's been three months, man. Definitely give your dreadlocks a break. Definitely give it some time to relax, man, and enjoy the process with your dreadlocks, man. I don't. I'm going back and forth. If I'm gonna get it done or not? Probably next week, but who knows? Even if I don't, man. Yeah, I'm still. I still love it. Yo, fellas, woman. Ladies, give your dreadlocks a break, man. You'll appreciate it, man. This is Vinny Matthews. I just want to give you guys a little update. I'm sorry if it's not too informative, but I hope you learned, did learn something. If not, it is what it is. I just want to give you guys a little update, man. Like this, these are my locks. Gee, these this is, this is what it is, what it is, man. Like it's it's a lot. It's a lot, man. But like you can still see the parts. You can still see the parts. Anyway, this car is getting all foggy up, man. So. Thanks for checking me out, man. This is Vinny Matthews. You guys enjoy your Halloween. Stay abundant. Stay reaching for your goals, manifesting your desires. And I'm out.